Hey, this is Tim here. Hope you're doing well. Um, today is final project or capstone project demonstration day, and uh, I want to actually show you one of the best uh, mechatronics projects we've ever um, that has ever happened here. So um, I have Brad and I have Amir. So say hello, <laughs> and Amir. Hey. All right, and um, you know this is their project, and uh, I told them I said, is there any way? Let me just zoom in here and you can see some of it. That, there's a dobot robot. This is um, a, a rack and pinion. Why, why am I explaining this? You guys should explain it. Um, yeah, go ahead there. What, so, what am I looking at here? All right, so we have a dobot magician, which is just like a robotic arm by the company Dobot. And then that's hooked up to an air compressor that's by Dobot as well. Okay. And then we have a system that comes in, rack and pinion with a, a motor that pushes out candy. And then once that gets triggered, using LED indications and limit switches, and it triggers the dobot to want to go grab candy. And then it uses a suction cup to pick up the candy. And then we have an LED, basically has a progress bar, which is just on the timer. I and see what's going on. I got it. Lovely. I didn't, it would have dropped the that candy. was wasted on me. Beautiful. How did you, uh, did, was this designed and built here? Yep. How well, did laser you? Laser cut, 3D, uh, 3D printed. 3D printed, they went through quite a few iterations. This was laser cut. Yep. 3D printed, 3D printed. These were bought and then cut in half. Yep. Where did you and get them from? McMaster Car. McMaster Car. Where did you get this fancy green button? Uh, we got the fancy green button off some website that you decided to order it off of. Automation Direct. Automation Direct, got it. And then uh, how does this whole rig, uh, how, where, what's the brains behind it? So basically this is an Arduino Mega, and then it, goes, it gets hooked up into a screw shield, which is just by Adafruit, and then it's all soldered in together, and then it connects into the actual um, Mega interface. Well, we could have used a regular Arduino, in case, but we had a Mega because originally we thought we needed one for the communication ports, but it wasn't necessary. Yeah. And then we have hooked up the uh, LCD screen right here, and that just basically displays everything also. And it just has a lot of power going to it because it needs to run a motor and all that too. No, it's a, so these guys, um, they, the whole point of it was to bring it to high schools and other places and uh, get, get the kids, give them some candy, get them to come over to the booth, give them a brochure, get them to sign up for mechatronics. So that it really is a, a, a fantastic job. And they get free candy out of it. And they get free candy out of it. So um, yeah, that's it. You know, we got it. Looks like we need more candy, though. But but uh, lovely job, guys. Well done.